Assalamualaikum. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. And today I am wearing all white because I'll be trying on wedding dresses for my wedding shoot in Seoul. And no, I'm not getting married. I'm still single. This is not an engagement ring. <laughs> this is just like a five dollar ring. What am I talking about? Anyways, I'm so honored to be able to experience this wedding shoot in Seoul thanks to the I Seoul You campaign. So yeah, I'll be trying on wedding dresses. So stay tuned. Because this is a very Korean wedding style dress, so obviously they don't have like full coverage dresses for Muslims. I brought my own inner, this white one. This is also mine, the hijab. They have like other dresses too that are like transparent, but as long as you wear the inner inside, it should be fine. So this is the second dress that I'm trying. I can't really move much because they only pinned the back. But they said once I choose between the two, then I'll be able to, then they're gonna really like fit the size for me. But yeah, this is the second dress. I like this one more. So they gave me two dresses and then I'm gonna have to choose. But once you choose the dress, they're gonna like really fit it to your body size. So you don't have to worry about that. I really like this one more because like, it's, I'm kind of reminded of like the Malaysian wedding dress, sort of, kind of. A lot of us wear this type of dresses now. It's kind of modern-ish, you know what I mean? They're gonna do something for my hair, but like, haha, <laughs> guess what, hijab. So they're giving me earrings, and I don't have the earring hole, but it's okay. Okay. There. Come down. Yeah. 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 What's that? Okay. Oh, why do I feel like the earrings really changed the look? It was like, I was like, meh before, but now I'm like, oh. oh yes. I feel, like fancy. <laughs> I feel fancy. I'm like, guys, look at this. Oh my god, don't you want to have your wedding in Seoul? <laughs> They haven't actually um, matched my shoe size yet, so I'm wearing these huge with my socks. Look how cool that is. My pink socks. Like there should be no problems if you're like Muslim and you want to find wedding dresses here. They also have like a lot of dresses that cover up, especially like for Koreans who also like to have like simple, very sophisticated, elegant dresses that are not too like. How do you say exposed? No churi denen dress, kind of. So yeah, don't worry, my Muslim friends. So we're now going to the hair makeup shop. I'm probably only gonna do my makeup, obviously, because like they can't do my hair, and like the hijab styling, I'm also gonna do it myself. But like, yeah, they're gonna do my makeup. Oh my god! <laughs> Taking a taxi, guys. <laughs> I heard the shop is only like ten minutes from here. So I already did my makeup this morning, but I did kind of like just only like 10 minutes. So they're gonna probably remove my makeup and do it again. So yeah, this is like a before, wait for the after. <laughs>
actually they asked me if I wanted to add something more and I was like make my nose smaller <laughs> so I asked them to do more shading on the nose and you can do that just ask for anything you want but yeah they're, they're already very good like I have like lash what do you call this false lash falsies I have falsies on but as you can tell they don't really put the whole the long eyelash they like cut it up so they put like a bit a bit a bit like parts of it so it doesn't look too heavy it still has that natural like I woke up like this look but yeah I think I'm just gonna go get my dress and then we're gonna go shoot so I'm gonna go try on the dress now see you in five minutes maybe less I don't know photographs here we're gonna have the shoot here usually they do it in the studio but like for us they're doing an outdoor shoot obviously because the weather's pretty but yeah so you'll see behind the scenes of a photo shoot can you see the details though like is it obvious like look at the details Look at the sequins. Ta da! Chocolate pickle pop? Chocolate. Not really pickle, because like, they really like. Mugoso, the back. Mugoso? They like, really tied the back tightly. Oh, really? Yeah. At first, I couldn't breathe in a taxi. I was like, <laughs> I'm sorry I didn't get dressed so, like, up for our big day. Yeah, you could have been the groom. Oh you know God. what I mean? Like, look. Like, <laughs> I didn't dress up. I didn't dress up well. Which is why we're not going through with the wedding. Yeah. Sorry, guys. Wedding go canceled. Wedding go canceled. Yeah. I didn't. Disrespectful. He effed up. Cool. He effed up. I'm finally done with the shoot. I walked in heels for two hours in this freaking palace. But it's beautiful, so I don't mind. But yeah, everything went well, alhamdulillah. So from the dress fitting, we went to the makeup shop. And there you could also do your hair. But like obviously, no hair for me, just the makeup. They did really pretty. I don't know if you can tell. And then from there, we just moved straight to Toksu Palace, Toksu Gong. So everything took like it was really efficient and I liked how everyone was very professional and they knew what they had to do. So I was like, you really don't have time to wait. So I and then like I heard it's actually, we're doing an outdoor shoot right now, but you can actually have an indoor shoot in the studio, like if you want to. And then you can also use two dresses. You guys could also experience a wedding like me, like in the Korean dramas. I'll leave a link, so don't worry. And also comment if you guys have any questions. Inshallah, I'll reply one by one. Yeah, thank you for watching. Right. Special thanks to the I Sell You campaign and also through the Go Korea Wedding platform. You guys can also have the same experience as me. So don't forget to reserve and come to Korea and have your wedding here too. Okay, bye. <laughs>